Hey, what's going on, pros? This is Diggy Man from the Venture Pros, and welcome to a how to set up your own server and invite your friends into it. No problem. One of my pros that recently been on the island asked me to show her, and um, I decided I was like, I haven't done one of these for a while, and um, I showed you guys how to set up a couple of things some in the past, but this is just a basic server to show you how to set it all up and invite your friends in all of it every detail that you need to know so first thing you're gonna do is go down to your you're gonna go to your dot your minecraft okay go to dot minecraft dot net and as you can see I'm logged in here and you're gonna go to find downloads follow my big hand and you go to downloads this is the one you want minecraft server exe for a regular virgin minecraft okay if you're gonna mod out you're gonna need the jar for the server but this is basically runs itself it's ready to go so you don't need to do a, a dot bat or anything like that to start it all right so you just click it and download it to your desktop make sure it goes to your desktop so you could find it quick or wherever you think is the best so see how it is right here nice and safe on my desktop you could poke it you could poke it but it still won't start the server don't poke it too much because you could break it Pokey, 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 pokey. Okay, first thing you're going to do is open a new folder, call it server or whatever you want. I'm going to call mine server and grab this and throw it inside. You're going to open it up and start up by left clicking it twice. Left clicking it, start run, and it will start running the server. As you can see, it is running. You can see that perfect now in your server file in here as you can see it now it's not alone anymore you can see that it has built a banded server list players list ops list server list number block whatever white list and this is the adjustment list this is the properties file for the server now you could only adjust these when it's off you could change them right now and save them but it won't affect the server until you shut down the server and turn it back on okay so I'm not gonna change anything there well well let me show you okay um, PVP because spike can't handle himself you're gonna put I, it's true right now but it comes as default true you could put false oops don't leave it in capital letters because it won't recognize it false and then you exit out and save changes now it's not working inside the server itself right now but it is set for the next time you turn on your server so it should be on so how to shut down the server do not press X and close out the window that's one way of doing it but that's one way of ruining your computer or ruining the server itself the, the best way to do it is to type in stop at the bottom here and it will save your world and there you go that's your world and now every time you start see up here in the server properties you can have you can name your world right up here see it says world as the same thing you see here you could change this and become whatever world you want it to become okay now how do I know Stiggy if this thing is working if this server is working well this is one way to run it let's run it real quick the server has been built already because it's there it goes and you're gonna start up your minecraft there you go so we're here let's go right in here and you're gonna press direct you're gonna put local host because you're the 
post and you're just gonna go jump into your Minecraft as I just did and there goes your server this is your server love it alright so everything does work you are opt and I am opt there we go that's pretty much it okay so let's disconnect and shut down make sure do not X this out make sure you stop your server just spell type type out stop right there and your server will save your world if you do not it might you might corrupt your world or even mess up the server itself okay so over here is your settings for your server you can put PvP false or whatever you want that's it pretty much it let's continue alright so your server is running and you jumped into it but now you want to make your friends jump in right you want to have some fun with other people and you need some couple of numbers okay need three numbers matter of fact so I'm going to show you where to get them. You're going to put go down to your start button and put CMD as in command and you're going to come up to your search bar here and you're going to put IP config and press enter. You're going to scroll up to here where your connection configurations are IP address everything this is the one you want the default gateway IP and it will be in here I have mine blocked so I don't want you guys all like feeling my whole server up and stuff you know what I mean I don't like that unless you're invited sorry alright but your number would be right here so after you write this down you jog this one this number down and then you have your IP4 number, you jot that one down too because you're going to need that one. Alright? And next, you could just close this out. Okay, so you have that number. And the one you really want is that default gateway. And you come up to your, your internet. And in here, your search bar, you write down you type in that default gateway okay so after you type that in you should have this little window pop up right here now you should have your IP that you just typed in right up on top of here I have mine blocked but you say what the hell is this now this is a link system modem and uh, I don't know if you have a different modem or but this is the most popular one but the password default is admin admin just write it down exactly like this and no capital letters just write it down and press OK okay so you pressed OK and now this different this different window pops up and you're like whoa what am I doing? I'm going to mess up my computer. Don't worry about it, guys. You're just in your modem settings. And you should be popping up in a different window, maybe. Just look for applications and games in your modem. And you should pop up into this area right here. Now, what you want to see is Minecraft written out here. And uh, the port that you want to set it at is 25565. To end at 25565 and protocol should be both and you should see your um, what is it PV4 that other number you jogged down that I told you to jog down an IP config right here and you should push enable if you're going to invite people into your server your personal server at home you should press enable and save right after and wait until it, the modem saves it 
So now your port will be open. Now, if you're not using your modem, your server, I mean, and you don't want people to be coming into your server without you knowing, you should have this unchecked. So you should get your own little password for it to get in and out of your modem and enable it when you are using it and un uncheck it when you're not. And always save your settings after you set your settings. So that's done let's go on okay so you set up your modem and everything and guys if you put admin in admin in there again and it didn't work it doesn't pop up I just want you to say don't worry about it turn off your modem wait about 20 seconds and turn it back on plug in the power and it should work no problem Maybe your modem was backed up or whatever it is. It's not used to your system yet. Or you never did this before. So maybe that's the problem. So let's move on here. Now, all the numbers that you have picked up now is nothing compared to what your friend needs. Okay, so now your friend needs a special number. So let's go get it. This is how you're going to do it. You're going to go to your internet again and up here in your search bar you're gonna put I P chicken okay Ooh, what the hell chicken dot com just like that guys you're gonna write it down and press enter so this buy chicken I mean IP chicken <laughs> I hate spy chickens now this spy chick I mean IP chicken dot com is a great site. It will show you exactly what number your buddy needs to connect. Now right here where I blocked out the number is your IP address that you give to your friend to put in his when he goes into his Minecraft like this. Let me open my Minecraft real quick and I'll show you. You're going to put it right in here. Right here. This is where you want to put it. Well, tell her or him where you want it. You put it right in here and if your server is running, it should be no problem to connect into you guys and you guys could connect over the internet and make sure your port is open and everything and it, that's it guys that's pretty much it now let's close this out and I hope you guys like this setup um, I hope it works for you let me know if it did make sure to share this with everybody um, we want to, to share the knowledge. That's what basically my channel does a lot. We do spotlight and show you how to install and just have a good time. And we want everybody else to have a good time. I am Diggy Man from the Venture Pros. And thanks for watching, guys. And I hope this helped you. I'm out.